Ooh, hey, a beautiful diamond. I wonder if this thing could get any better. Let's try this. Hold on a second. It's actually going to work. What? In this video, we can cook anything to make super overpowered items. But before we dive in, check out these stats right here, folks. If you haven't subscribed already, make sure you click that subscribe button down below. Click the like button and leave a comment because together we can team up and take down the YouTube algorithm. All right, folks, we have brand new things that we can smelt and by brand new i mean in this world we can smelt anything let me just show you exactly what i'm talking about but first things first of course we are going to need to have a furnace if we want to smelt some stuff and we're going with option two instead of going to the mountain that you can see in the corner of the screen over there we're going to go south stone back to our gorgeous crafting table we got ourselves a furnace and inside this furnace the power of everything magnificent happens inside this furnace i'm gonna drop an oak log on the top half of that furnace right there and below that we're gonna drop ourselves a little oak plank and now watch what happens when we cook up this oak log instantly <laughs> We get ourselves 64 oak planks. Can 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 we do a cobblestone? Let me put one cobblestone in there. One of our oak planks, now that we never have to worry about having enough supply of oak planks ever again. Cobblestone, one, two, three, let's see. Boom, 64 cobblestone. Okay, so smelting is extremely overpowered, but it doesn't just work for being able to multiply items. We can use smelting to improve or create items that would normally normally be uh just average but it doesn't just work to multiply items we could use the smelting or cooking inside minecraft create some items that are a little bit insane grab one iron ore here this is literally all that we're going to need is one iron ore toss this iron ore inside of our furnace and with one piece of coal we're gonna smelt that bad boy down into the usual nothing crazy an iron ingot but wait what 16 iron ingots and we can smelt the iron ingot itself hold on a second no and it turns into 16 more you gotta be absolutely kidding me we can just duplicate these iron ingots over and over and over again we don't even need any more of those iron ore over there <laughs> hold on a second if i take a crafting table out and i craft one two three more furnaces boop 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 and then inside those furnaces one piece of coal and then i just go back in and boom 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 we are going to get 16 iron ingots from each of these furnaces what is that 16 times 3 16 32 49 48 that was so embarrassing let's take one of these stacks of iron ingots craft ourselves a few sticks toss these iron ingots in there inside the crafting table get ourselves our iron pickaxe one stick drop ourselves some iron ingots in there we got ourselves the irons can we put this inside the furnace and just blast it we can what is going to happen if we blast ourselves i thought that was going to be more spectacular than an iron nugget. That's really disappointing after all of that. We need to find diamond. The diamond will be better. Oh, but there we go. Little piece of diamond. Are you kidding me? All of that searching for one measly diamond. That's all right. Grab our furnace. Poor furnaces. Take this diamond, toss it inside the furnace. Place one of these coal inside the furnace with that diamond. Cook that diamond up. And then when we cook the diamond, we get ourselves... <laughs> Look at this. A fire diamond. Oh, we got to collect a few more of these. Boom. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. eight that, that's insane. Okay. One, I guess we made up for it, huh? Place back down our two furnaces. We'll split them four and four. Because with these fire diamonds inside the crafting table, toss down some sticks. And let's use the fire diamond. See if we can craft ourselves up a pickaxe. Oh my word. No way. A fire Fire diamond pickaxe. What does this thing do? Mine? Oh, it's super, super, super fast. This thing should not be legal. Go to a uh, iron ore. Oh, what did you do? Oh, it automatically smelts the iron ore instantly smelted iron ore right i mean ah we've got 
the furnace to be able to duplicate all these to 16. So is it faster? Probably not. Useful? Maybe so. But if we take this fire diamond pickaxe to a diamond ore, I wonder if we're going to get fire diamond from the diamond ore. Dig for diamond. We got to go this direction. I think this uh, tunneling strategy is going to be super, super, super overpowered. Ooh, wait a second. Hold on. Get out our fire diamond pickaxe diamond ore. Will we drop a fire diamond from this ore? Let's find out. We did! Ooh, wait, it's more than one, too. Oh my gosh. We had six fire diamonds from that previous vein, and now we've got 10. Four fire diamonds we just got. Four more. Four more. Four more. 22 fire diamonds. Okay, these things are insane. If I go to the crafting table and I craft these fire diamonds into a helmet. Oh! fire diamond helmet i bet that's gonna be delicious oh what are these flames what are these flames get the redstone out of here clear the way i hear some mobs are they attracted to me because i've got the fire diamonds i figured out your secrets i figured out your secrets i'm a little scared i, I hear them all around me Ooh, can i craft a fire diamond axe i can Back up to the surface. Wait a second. We've got unlimited fire resistance from our helmet, I think. I hear some mobs. Can we just go face them right now? I feel like we have nothing to worry about with this fire diamond helmet on. Mobs, I hear you guys over here probably. Yes, I see you. Ooh, they catch on fire. They instantly catch on fire. Oh, but they're also very strong. I'm gonna go away. I'm gonna go away. Not gonna go away. That is not as powerful as I thought it would be. We need the full set i think Do we have any more let's use the rest of our fire diamond we need to get a couple more sets of oh we're just missing a few pieces fire diamond boots the only thing we need is the chest plate right now just one more stack of diamonds and we'll be able to get the fire diamond chest and we'll be all set to go Ooh, but we've got three fire diamonds right now well we search for a couple more stacks or veins well we search for a couple more veins what if we craft fire diamond axe these fire diamonds are so overpowered oh my gosh hey where'd that where'd that spider go hey buddy boy there you are it sets him on fire when we whack him oh and he's gone so fast right here for the last chest piece Ooh, okay don't throw that in the lava safely secure the final pieces of diamond and we're gonna have a full set of fire diamond armor that's four eight that's 12 that's that's way too many diamonds there from one set thanks to this fire diamond pickaxe the last thing we need is just this chest piece right here boom full fire diamond armor all the way around and before we head back to the service grab one of these emeralds here okay now we got to go test out this axe because the sword insane pickaxe insane armor insane and somebody's trying to fight us already who's who dare come to our armor right now oh i can't set you on fire because you're in the water and both of you have no chance. What? We actually got a disc from this skeleton right here. That's hilarious. The diamond fire axe, though. Whoa. Oh, that's sweet. That's really good. It just flames it up and then boom. Did it drop gunpowder? Did that just happen? No way. That must have been from the creeper. It had to have been. It doesn't make any sense that it would drop gunpowder. It doesn't make any sense at all. Every log is a flame and capture no way how is this working it doesn't make any sense take our one emerald though here in the furnace we have a couple more coal left i'm gonna just grab toss those in there and then toss our emerald and we can cook it no way let's see i'm actually kind of nervous for this we gotta find a village as soon as we get this thing and see what they'll trade them for wait it turned into a full stack oh my golly it's like the planks the planks and the emeralds they're the same they're from the same family why are they from the same family who even cares just grab the emerald village village anywhere village village here i've got some secret emeralds for you folks are you willing to trade you definitely are willing to trade what huh we've got enchanted flame apple flaming dragon bow or extract i'll i'll take i'll take one of each flaming dragon bow or extractor and we've got ourselves an enchanted flame apple what does this thing do Munch it down. We got orange hearts. Ooh, did that cow just die? That cow died. 
that cow died. I think our enchanted flame apple accidentally incinerated our cows. That could be an instant kill option. Let me get a couple more of those uno, dos, tres enchanted flame apples i'll grab a couple of those and this ore extractor that we traded for these emeralds smelted are so insane can this thing dig it can dig uh what else does it do it doesn't do anything to the dirt blocks grass nothing what about the oh it digs super wait a second it's so fast on the stone blocks stay out of my way you creeper by this ore extractor breaks the blocks instantly and it drops a random ore and get this if we get a diamond ore from this we just have to pick it up emerald diamond place that diamond ore down pull back our fire diamond pickaxe mine that diamond ore down we get or more fire diamonds for that delicious fire diamond look how do you guys know about this thing how did you guys this is insane get rid of the wool we don't need that anymore we can just farm these ores because we have the op smelting everything is so easy to farm crush everything instantly and take these diamonds down easily boom just place all of them down and then go back through with our fire diamond pickaxe and mine them all right back down and just farm these fire diamonds. That's insane. But this flaming dragon bow, if it's a one shot nuke, there's only one place that we should definitely put this to the test. Mrs. Dragon herself. And if things don't quite work out exactly as I'm expecting, I uh, got a few enchanted uh, flaming apples that we can eat because when I do that, everything dies. So that's fantastic. And the bow. Oh, where are you? Where are you? Can I hit you in one shot? Time the shot perfectly. I missed. She's perching! She's perching! Quickly, 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 quickly. Eat! Eat! It worked! She's gone! One apple! Most OP item in the entire game has now become that furnace right there.